Avoid mistakes. Set up a perfectly functioning compensation system quickly and safely. This is the goal of the user-guided commissioning of the Power Factor Controller Baylock CX Plus. Regular devices do not interact with the user during commissioning. The user already needs to know which parameters have to be set up or where he or she has to look it up in the manual. The Baylock CX Plus has an innovative algorithm allowing even inexperienced users to do the initial commissioning efficiently and correctly. This is achieved through a dialogue in which the CX Plus requests the necessary parameters step by step. The device recognizes when being connected for the first time. Then the option First Setup is offered. With the acknowledgement Yes, the input process of the required parameters begins. First, the nominal voltage UN is queried. It can be adjusted by pressing a button or be acknowledged as unchanged. The entered value is displayed for one second after input. If a voltage transformer is used, then the transformer factor must be entered. If there is no potential transformer, the value remains at 1. Once the parameters UN and PT have been entered, the CX Plus recognizes and indicates the type of connection of the voltage measurement. The user confirms this setting or corrects it. The measured ULL value is now displayed for 3 seconds. This serves as a check of the correctness of the previous entries. Then the current transformer factor CT must be entered. For a 500 to 5 converter, this would be 100. Again, the value is displayed for one second. The current measurement value appears on the display for three seconds for checking purposes. This is followed by an option if the controller should run an automatic query of all switching outputs or whether this should happen manually. This process is called Automatic Initialization, AI for short. The Power Factor controller now switches all outputs on and off successively in several passes. The progress is shown in the display. The phase offset angle between current and voltage is determined automatically during this process. After successful completion of the AI, the individual step types can be checked under the menu item out and be adjusted if necessary. Finally, the power factor control is activated by confirming the menu item PFC on. Commissioning is now completed successfully. The CX Plus shows the message, first set up OK in the display, and the control can start. If the automatic initialization AI is not selected, the phase offset PO must be entered manually. For this, the AI option is confirmed with NO. This is followed by the input of the phase offset angle PO. During adjustment of the phase offset, the current cosine phi is shown in the display. This allows the current phase offset angle to be found easily and safely, an otherwise very error-prone process. Now the types of each output of the controller are set. These can be set fix on, fix off, or to automatic. Once again, commissioning is completed when the power factor control is switched on, PFC on. The CX Plus shows the message first set up OK in the display and the automatic control can begin. A complex task becomes transparent and failsafe due to the user-guided initialization. This means faster commissioning, less frustration and troubleshooting and thus more satisfied customers and electricians. Tough, trusted, Baylook.